Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm Phil. We got Bob Seeger. This is Sam. We got Night Moves. This is a Bob Seeger track. This is our third track from Bob Seeger. Mm -hmm. And it is coming to light because of Mark. Yes, another request from Mark. Thank you so much, Mark. Yeah, we did, we've done uh, Turn the Page and Old Time Rock and Roll from yeah. Bob Seeger. I now, love that last one. Yeah, now what order these get released in is yet and remains to be seen. We may release this one before we release Old Time Rock and Roll. Uh, but uh, if not, if we've already released Old Time Rock and Roll, you can go and check that one out if you yes. haven't done so already, if you have. And uh, keep coming back to the channel. Thank you so much for all the support. And we love having you guys coming around and checking out out all this new music comedy and sports with us building up this cool community has been a lot of fun yeah it's been amazing and it's been you know so much fun to experience new things all thanks to you guys and you know the comments that you provide for us and the recommendations and the donations and requests so thank you so much part of those comments with bob Seeger because we said in that first one we're like yes. who is this guy <laughs> yeah and uh, a lot of those comments were how do you not know who bob Seeger is and, yeah uh, they were like how have you guys never heard of him so. yeah and apparently he has really popular songs but uh, we may not recognize the name bob Seeger. so Maybe we'll recognize this one, Night Moves. Not yeah. really sure what to expect, but uh, I've really enjoyed both the songs from him thus far. Me so too. We'll see if he goes three for three. Yeah, and we have a quiz question for you guys to see if you guys Almost know a fun that. fact about Bob Seger. So we want to know if you know what guitar manufacturer made a model exclusively for Bob Seger. All right, with that said, are you ready? Yes, I am. I was asking them. Oh, are you guys ready? I am. <laughs> All right, let's roll. <clears throat> I'm a little too tall, could have used a few pounds. Tight pants, points, hollering down. She was a black haired beauty with big dark eyes and points all her own, sudden way up high. Way up firm and high. Out past the cornfields where the woods got heavy. Out in the back seat of my 60 Chevy. Working on mysteries without any clues Working on our night moves Trying to make some front page driving news Working on our night moves In the summertime Some high in the sky song We were just young and restless and bored Living by the sword And we'd steal away every chance we could To the back room, to the alley, or the trusty woods I used to have she used me, but neither one cared We were getting our share Working on our night moon Trying to lose an awkward teenage blues Working on a night moves mm -hmm. And it was summertime mm -hmm. Sweet summertime, summertime All right, Bob. Give me a minute here. <laughs> what do you think so far? Oh, it's great. Love it. It's um, interesting, you know, again, a little bit different than what we've heard mm -hmm. from Bob thus far. This has got like an R&B almost, like a rhythm and blues feel to it. Uh, you know, his, vo his vocals got a lot of soul and mm -hmm. this raspiness. And I love his vocal. Yeah, it's awesome. And uh, the feel of the song, uh, like I said, this teenage love song of you know experimentation for the first time and uh you know kind of 
painting the picture of whether it's his experience or, you know, people maybe that are growing up their experience Mm -hmm. of meeting their partners, we'll say, and, uh, you know, telling the, painting the picture, telling the story of, you know, this nostalgia of kind of everybody probably reflects when they hear the song, right. About their own experiences that they had. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, you just got a great, way to tell that story using his raspy vocal that we talked yeah. about but yeah, at the same vocal. time musically it's it's got a great vibe to it it's real you know feel good track and and uh, i just i love the way it sounds overall it's really well put together yeah i love it. it has like kind of like this great laid back kind of groove like it has a good groove but it's more of like a laid back kind of song i feel like in my opinion chill um, vibe yeah which really allows his vocal to stand out also to me in my opinion like i feel like his vocal is kind of the star of the show in this mm-hmm. and the instrumentation sounds great but it's like complimentary to his vocal um so i feel like you know it sounds great and you know his his vocal is my favorite part so far yeah I like the lyrics too like you said like that nostalgia kind of feel yeah and you know just the way he's kind of like mm-hmm, like you know like, <laughs> yeah and, yeah and adding these like just little ad lib layers in yeah there. that's really cool i can also you know visualize you know, driving a car on a sunny day because he makes yeah. mention of summertime and yeah. you know, having the windows down and just, yeah. you know, a nice cruising song. Yeah, and I think that that vibe, like you just said, is kind of like what gives me that laid back vibe because like people kind of tend to like hum or like be like, mm, mm-hmm. like, you know, when they're kind of like laid back chilling, like you said, driving or just hanging out. Yeah. And that's what kind of what it makes yeah. me think well, of. Well, let's, let's see where we're going to go. We still got another three minutes here, but I very much enjoy it thus far. Me too. Summertime, summertime. the lightning And it's funny how the night moves When you just don't seem to have as much to lose Strange how the night moves With autumn closing in So you enjoyed it. I did. I very much enjoyed that. 
I feel like I could add that to my like just chill out. I feel like too that's like a perfect like cottage kind of song too. Mm. I figured this would be something that you would enjoy as we were getting midway through it. Uh, yeah. I figured that would be your kind of song. Yeah, this would be my weekend vibing out song. I enjoyed it too. It's a great feel, great vocal performance. Mm-hmm. Like he just yeah. destroyed that, really showed off his ability. I mean, we I think we said in the other ones that he was great in that department, but I feel like this one was next level and showing his ability to kind of create a nice dynamic mm-hmm. and uh, you know emphasize with his delivery of the vocals on, on certain words, really make it stand out, add a little bit of that gritty passion into it. So all that stuff was really cool. Yeah, no, Bob Seger killed it. Agreed. And uh, I think we have to give you an answer at this point to a pop quiz question. We do. And that question was, what guitar manufacturer made a model exclusively for him? And the answer is Gibson. Gibson. Yeah. That's the answer. Yeah. That's a very popular guitar manufacturer. Even I know what that is before I got into all this. So So you got to be legit if they're going to put... put a make a guitar after you and i don't know the popularity of the guitar itself from that yeah. version but yeah uh, no, me either. that's pretty cool and so bob seeger is three for three for me yeah no me too i really enjoyed them i'd say the second i actually I really like the first two so all three of them are i was gonna say the second and the third were my favorite but actually all three of them are yeah they're all great fabulous so hopefully you guys enjoyed uh our reaction if you did hit the like button for us leave us yes. a comment as well let us know where you want us to go next with bob seeger and uh, make sure you hit the subscription button so you don't miss anything going forward yes. and we'll see you in our next video thanks for watching guys see you next time